What's going on guys and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's VR Help Wanted. In the last video, we repaired Bonnie or at least we attempted to and we also ran into Plush Trap. So if you haven't had a chance to watch that video, you definitely want to do so. But in today's video, we're hopping back into the game and we're going to be trying to do a few different things here. I actually have to mention something here because I was recording and uh, I beat Night 2 of FNAF 2. I beat Night 1 of FNAF 3 and I beat the Nightmare BB minigame of the Dark Rooms along with the Bonnie minigame of Parts and Service. And then my game crashed. Well, not the game crashed, but my whole power went out and I lost all of the footage. It's really unfortunate, but luckily, luckily, <laughs> I it, we didn't really miss anything because FNAF 2 Night 2 or FNAF 3 Night 1, literally nothing happened. Springtrap doesn't even show up. Um, and then FNAF 2 Night 2, nothing happened either. So yeah, you didn't miss anything. But what we're going to go ahead and do in today's video, though, is we're going to hop back in and we're going to go ahead and do the dark room again. I'm going to show you guys Nightmare BB because this is something we haven't seen before. So why not? Definitely got to show it to you guys at least. And uh, let's go ahead and hop in, though. All right. So, man, I can't believe I already beat this. So I'm not going to be trying to beat it here. But I just want to show you guys some gameplay of it. Okay. So 90 seconds. Now, there's a tape here. But my I can't reach it. Because my... Oh, dude, it's so frustrating. My uh, my sensors, I bought two extra ones. Oh, God, he's moving. Okay, I bought two extra ones, and I still can't reach the ground. It's super frustrating. It's one of the things I hate about VR is, uh, you know, trying to hit anything on the ground just doesn't work. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, oh my God, dude, that's so creepy how you can see him moving like that. Okay, wait for it. Oh, look at that. He's freaking out at the doorway. He's, like, twitching and stuff. It's so creepy. Okay, he's not there. 55 seconds. I'm going to try to beat this, but I don't think we'll be able to. I beat it when I was freaking. Before the power went out, I beat it. It's so unfortunate. Oh, gosh. Let's wait. Okay, he's not... What the... What the heck? Why did that laugh sound like he was behind me? Oh! He was running towards me. We're good, though. We're good. He's still sitting there. Wait for it. Oh, my God. I think... I feel like every time he talks, he's going to move, but he doesn't. It's so weird. 29 seconds. We're... Oh, what is up with that laugh? Wait for it. What the? He's still just sitting. What is this? He's just sitting there. Oh, oh my God. He moved that way. Oh, he's not there. Guys, get ready for a jump scare. Oh my God. He's not there. Eight, seven, six. Oh my God. He's not there. Go for it. He's not there. No, we lost. What happened to that? Oh, oh. Oh my god, dude, that was so close to me. Oh my god, that was so intense. Okay, I'm returning the menu. No, 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 I'm returning the menu. Holy crap. Oh my gosh. Uh, see, last video that you guys didn't get to see, I did not get jump scared by him. So, oh my gosh, that was intense. Okay, so there's one more thing I wanted to try, though, because I wanted to see, because if you guys remember, this box over here, it takes us to that, like, black light world. And I want to see if we go to the prize corner or if we try going to the showtime, what will happen. Oh, by the way, guys, we now have nine. My hand is gone. My hand is gone. No, <laughs> that bug is still in the game. It's like whenever you eat something, your hand just disappears. Okay, well, whatever. This hand still works. So I want to try going to the black. What the heck? That was not there before. There's a tape player there. That was not. That was not there before. I know for sure as a fact that it wasn't. Interesting. Okay. Um, hold on. Can I touch this? Oh, you can! I touched it with my right hand. It's taking us somewhere. What the heck? Uh... Where are we? There's the tapes that we unlocked right here. Tape one through four. And then a tape player. What? I can hear that guy here, too. Dude, there's something up with this game. There's somebody watching us or something. There's something up with this game. All right, so we have the tapes here. I guess we can just play them. They're not titled tape one. Hello? Let's see. Can you hear me? That's Don't the female. Exit this room, okay? This isn't a mistake. This room isn't a mistake. I had to hide these logs away from the core gameplay files <gasps> in a place that only a beta tester would look and in a Wait. place where the files could be protected. I just really, really hope that the next development team finds this before the game is released to the public. This game has some kind of malicious code in it that we haven't been able to fully contain or even understand for that matter. We're over budget and out of time. But that's not the reason that we're shutting down. Listen, 
I have to keep this short so the file size will be small enough to fly under the radar. There are more. They may not be in order. Hello? Okay, Can so now. Wait, so what hand unit said was right. He said that there was like some some kind of beta and things were going bad and, and don't worry about it. We're within we're in a game within the game. This was made. What? Okay, let's do tape two. This is getting interesting. I saw it for the first time today. There was a character I couldn't make out who it was standing at the end oh of the Oh my hall. god. I thought it was just bugged out. So I made a note of it and kept playing. No. But then it was looking in the window. And not like Chica or Bonnie would. It was like it was actually looking in the window. No. Seeing what I was doing. No. Oh, I can tell where this is going. So she was playing the game, testing it in the FNAF 1 location. And this thing showed up and was watching her. Oh. I think I know what's behind me talking. So we're within a game within a game where there's some kind of virus or something that's... Oh, no. Okay, tape three. Oh, this is getting creepy. I heard a pretty heated conversation this morning between Dale, our manager, and someone else on the line. It really feels like this project is in trouble. In no small part because of the lawsuit, I'm sure. There has to be a lawsuit. There's no way there isn't. It happened in this building just a few doors down from me. I think it's made worse by the fact that Jeremy tried to tell us something was Jeremy. wrong. Jeremy! But as a dev team, we all just saw it as a challenge to find what the problem was and fix it. Who could have known that? I have to go. So this is a FNAF game based in the actual FNAF universe. I think. What? Okay, tape four, have last one. Have you ever one. heard of a guillotine paper slicer? It sounds made up, but it's an actual piece of office equipment. I didn't even know we had one in the supply room. I guess the more common at businesses that do a lot of graphic design work. I remember seeing one when I was still in school, and even then, I knew how dangerous it looked. I was always afraid of losing a finger. That seems so silly now. Jeremy used to do design work. I guess that's how he knew it was there. What the heck? Okay, this is getting very interesting. So there's somebody in this game with us that's like a virus animatronic or something. And and he, he's in this game with us, for sure as a fact. That's, yeah, this is creepy. This is really creepy. So we could be being watched right now. Somebody could be watching us right now. Wait. I guarantee this is like the nightmare mode of the game, right? And she said in FNAF 1, I'm assuming it was FNAF 1 because she talked about Freddy and Chica and Bonnie and Chica. This nightmare night right here, whatever she saw is in this night. It has to be. Whatever she saw is here in this challenge. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Um, let's ba go back to what we came here to do though. Let's go to the prize corner. What the heck? there that's it interesting okay so it looks like everything's the same here though right i think so yeah nothing's new everything's the same all right cool that's why i came here all right so good thing we decided to check this out though because we just found whatever that was these tapes look it's gone now so this guy in the background behind me that has to be what she saw whatever this this thing is talking behind me I guarantee you it's this virus that's watching her or whatever she's talking about. Oh my gosh, this is getting insane. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back to this though. I want to go ahead and do um, the Parson service again. We're going to go ahead and do Bonnie again just in case you guys didn't see it. Well, obviously you guys didn't see it because, you know, my footage got corrupt. But I'll do it again for you guys, even though this is really scary and I really shouldn't. But I will for you all, all right? I will. I'll do it. <laughs> oh Welcome my back to service. I hate this. I hate oh, no. this. It looks like Bonnie's guitar is out of tune and must be recalibrated. You know how gigantic he is, by the way. First, we must access his harmonization module located inside his secondary throat pipe. This is so pipe. realistic, by the way. To access the throat pipe, both eyes must first be removed. You must be as precise as possible when removing the eyes from their respective sockets. First, firmly grip Bonnie's left eye 
and carefully remove it from its socket. Okay. Ah. Uh, Great reach job. It. Deposit the left eye in the cleaning receptacle on your left. Well done. Now, firmly grip Bonnie's right eye and carefully remove. Deposit the right eye in the cleaning receptacle. Good job. To open Bonnie's faceplate, carefully press the two buttons. Look well done. Oh gosh, I hate that one. Bonnie's harmonization module. Press the blinking button inside Bonnie's secondary throat pipe. To Blue, calibration green, mode. red, yellow. Yellow. Something is not right. One of those notes is out of tune. You may push the button again to replay the audio check. Blue, Press the colored green, button that corresponds red, to the incorrect yellow. note. Yellow. Press the blinking button again to verify your work. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> no, don't jump scary. Yellow, it worked. It worked, it worked. I did it. I did Great it. Great job. Bonnie is in tune and ready for his solo. Let's close him up. Simply replace both eyes in the same order that you removed them, then close up the faceplate, and we'll call it a day. Okay. Uh. Left. Oh. Right. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, both buttons. <laughs> oh. Well done. Oh my god, I did that it. concludes your parts oh, and I services it. task. See you next time. I hate that one. I hate that one so much. Oh my god, I hate that one. It's so intense. Even though I already did it, it's so intense. Oh, wait, what? I didn't get this last time. I'm pretty sure last time I got a Bonnie plush. But this time I got a Freddy. What the heck? Interesting. Huh. All right, so now you guys are caught up to where I was in the last video. <laughs> so that's good. And luckily I recorded again because last time I didn't find those tape things. So that's really good. Okay, so let's see, FNAF 1, FNAF 2, let's go to, um, okay, so we unlock parts and service Chica, we have vent repair, and then we have night terrors, so let's do Chica, and then we'll try out vent repairs, and then go from there. Alright, so we have Chica now, grab and release, pull trigger, okay, what else, push buttons, make repairs, sounds easy enough, let's hope for the best here. Oh man, this is gonna be intense. Welcome back to parts and oh, service. Pizza order. There have been customer complaints about Chica's acrid smell. Sounds like Chica has been rummaging around the kitchen again. Remove all food particles from Chica's exterior and place it in the refuse bin on your right. Okay. Oh, there's a coin in here. What oh, tape? Wait, hold on. Oh, we got two coins. All right, so cool. Let's do this. All pizza goes in here. Uh, okay. Good job. Good Make job. sure Chica is not hiding any other treats inside her beak. To open her beak, oh, carefully what? press the two buttons Look at how located huge. on the sides of Chica's head. He's huge. Okay. Uh, they're, they're too far oh! It looks like Chica oh! has picked up some unwanted friends. <laughs> to clear the oh! infestation, apply the Fazbear Entertainment Restaurant Grade Chemi Spray to Chica's exterior. Press the button under the hanging canister to activate the Chemi Spray. Uh, okay. Avoid inhaling the Chemi Spray. Exposure to cleaning, disinfecting, and maintenance chemicals may result in respiratory problems, skin, or eye irritation. Go too late job. for that. Now reattach Chica's upper arm, hand, and cupcake plate. Upper arm, hand. Okay. Boom! Okay. Cupcake. Well done. Oh no. It looks like Chica needs another dose of the chemi spray. Oh! Why is it moving? Do not let the infestation spread. Be sure to give the canister button why is another it? push as needed. Why is the cupcake the cupcake move? The Return cupcake move. Cupcake to Chica's Wait. plate. What? What? Where did it go? Return where? the cupcake to Chica's where plate. Where did it go? I don't know where it went. <laughs> Please place the cupcake where did it? on the plate. I don't I don't know where it is. Where the heck? Return the cupcake. Oh my god, no trunks, get down! Plate. Trunks, get down! Wait, I saw it! Where'd it go? Oh my god, wait, hold on. Oh my god, okay. Okay, that was a disaster. Um, what happened with the cupcake? It was like moving everywhere. 
And then Trunks started jumping. <laughs> you guys couldn't see it, but I started panicking in real life because Trunks was climbing up me. There have been customer complaints what if I just started? about Chica's acrid smell. Sounds like Chica has been rummaging around the kitchen again. Remove all food particles. Good job. Huh? Make sure Chica is not Let's hiding skip any it. other treats inside her beak. <sighs> this to is scary. Beak, carefully press the two buttons the mic. located okay. on the sides of Chica's head. Okay. He's, oh my gosh. Chica has in the way of the mic. Wanted friends. To clear the infestation, apply the Fazbear Entertainment restaurant grade chemi spray to Chica's exterior. Press the button. Avoid inhaling the chemi spray. Exposure to cleaning, disinfecting, and maintenance chemicals may result in respiratory. Okay, hold on. I gotta stand up for this. Clearly. Irritation. Hold on. You guys Good aren't job. gonna be able to hear me too well, now but I have to. Now attach Chica's upper arm, hand, and cupcake plate. Okay, so this. This. Well done. Oh no! It looks like Chica needs that. another dose of the chemi spray. Okay, watch the cupcake. Do not let the infestation spread. Return what? the cupcake what? to Chica's what? plate. Come here! Come here! I got him! Great oh, job! Oh, I did it! I did Chica it! Chica is ready yes. to serve pizza and hugs to the kids I did again. It. Take a complimentary slice of pizza for a job well done. No, thank you. Okay. No. I don't want to. This is Chica's pizza. Go no. On. Take it. I'm not taking it. Wait, no, the fact that he reinforced that. I'm not taking it. Eat it. I'm not eating it. No, I refuse. Eat it. I'm not, no. I'm not eating it. Eat it. I'm not, I'm not going to eat it. There, there's something up with this. If, if he it. says, okay, I have to eat it. Uh, See you next time. No. Oh no! Let me out! Let me out! Oh my god! Okay, she didn't jump scare me. Okay, Trunks is upset though. <laughs> he's climbing all over me. You guys can't see it, but he's he's wondering like what the heck I'm doing. Oh, oh, the body plush again. Okay, cool. Let's continue. Holy, that one was intense and very scary, but we survived it luckily. Oh my gosh! Are you having fun yet? That's great to hear. Oh, what the heck is that? Who is? <laughs> Trunk, Trunks is freaking out too. Trunks, do you see that too? Oh my gosh, there's somebody over there. That's what she saw. Who is that? What the heck? Uh, who is that? Oh my gosh, that's something that we've never seen before. I don't know who that is, but they need to stay over there. Oh my gosh, hold on. Let me just readjust the mic so you guys can hear me, but who in the heck is that? That's, I've never seen whoever that is before. Um, what is going on though? Parts and service, next up is Freddy. Oh my god, wait, hold on. We got a new, a new tape. Oh, he follows us. He follows us. This is the virus that she was talking about. This is that thing. It just stays there. Okay, go here, go here, go here. Oh no, this is getting intense and scary. Okay, we have a new tape. Tape number five. Let's go. The drawers have been emptied out. Someone was here. I don't think it was spring cleaning either. No, there was plastic on the floor. Someone was definitely here during the night. It had to have been the client. I mean, they sent us that stuff in the first place with no explanation, told us to scan it, Said it would expedite the process so we wouldn't need to program any pathfinding ourselves. It was a budget thing, I guess. It was just junk. Circuit boards and things like that. Looked pretty old. Somehow, though, there was usable code on some of it. It seemed to take hold by itself. Things started changing. But then, he started appearing. <gasps> At least that's what Jeremy said. That's what Jeremy said. Jeremy saw him too. He started appearing. See, this is what they saw. Oh my gosh. Whoever this, whatever this thing is, this is what they saw. Okay, take us back. Take us back. No, nope, take us back. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I'm going to end this video here. This is getting in insane. This is... I expected to hop into this game and just play some mini games and have a good time, find a few secrets, but 
This whole game is a secret. There's lore. There's whoever this is that we've never seen before. And it's possibly what I don't I don't know who this could be, but this is insane. Guys, I'm gonna end this video here. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and little bell icon. Because trust me, in the next video, I, I think something insane is gonna happen with this guy. Because he's just sitting there watching us. So I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.